Hey, where are you off to? We made plans, remember? Yeah, I'm just going to pick up Angela from the airport. I won't be, I won't be out there for long. <laughs> that explains the glint of glow I see on your face. So, something on my, there's something on my face. You're very stupid. Can you stop being serious? Start catching subs when one is thrown at you. I can't believe you, 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 you thought something was on your face. I don't have time for this. Wait, 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 wait. Um, make sure you get groceries on your way. I don't blame you. Now see finish the course of this thing, Abby. Make sure you finish that pitch deck before I get back. I will look at it when I get back. Yes, sir. <laughs> Love is in book. Right here beside me. <laughs> you know, my baby here is so amazing. The most gorgeous man any woman could dream of. <laughs> really? Oh, that's very good. You know, Kevin is actually taking me to Maldives. Mm hmm. I mean, we made so much fun together. Yes. Of course, trust me. You know, I will update you on every move. Everything, yes, I will update you. <laughs> you should trust me on that. All right, darling. Just have lots of fun, okay? Because you deserve it. All right, girl. Bye. What? What happened? Why are you back from school so early? I was sent back. Okay, sit down first. Why? Because I have not paid my school fees and the teacher said I should not return unless I have the money with me. Why is your teacher unnecessarily wicked? I gave her half the payments yesterday and I promised to complete the next one next week. Why did she have to send you home? Don't worry, okay? You go back to school next week. You must be very hungry. Ah, the mama woman did not come out, but she will soon come out, okay? Here, you can eat this while she comes out. Hmm? It's okay. Wait, wait, Angie. What is it? Shouldn't we be going inside? Should we? Mm hmm You know I am not taking you to any vacation anywhere, right? Yeah. Why? What was that on the phone with your friend? <laughs> forget about that. I don't want to forget about it. Just uh, answer the question. What was that? Come on, puppy. I mean, is this supposed to be an issue? And it's not an I mean, issue. I, I just got back from a very long flight. Don't you think I should be resting? Then answer the question. Fine, if you insist. Well, she's on a vacation with her fiance, and I don't want her to think that my own relationship life is boring. So you had to leave a lie? A lie? No. I mean, I just had to create something to save my face. That's all. I mean, that's not a lie. So what is it then? Exaggeration. I mean, just a little lie for a good cause. Wow. Mm-hmm. So, can I... We can.
What about this? What do you think? You did this yourself? I think you underestimate me way too much. But that's based on how unserious and childish you act sometimes, but this, this is good. This, this, this is amazing. This, this surpasses my expectation. I think this might just be the winning pitch deck. Oh, oh, oh. Hold on now. Don't get ahead of yourself. Mm, this might be good, but Mr. George is a hard man to please. So they just take hey, it one. Hey, hey. Uh, I am uh, sorry to interrupt you guys, but Steve, can I borrow my baby for a moment? Uh, babe, can't you just wait? We're about to finish something here. No, Let... no, babe. Look, he can't wait. What I want to show you is very important. You can go. I'll take it up from here. Oh. Thank you, Steve. Okay. Let's go. Come on. Very important. And you, you bought me a female dress. What? <laughs> no, Papi. I bought the dress for me. For a date night. Mm -hmm. So, which do you think I should wear? This one or this one? But I think green will be perfect for a date. What do you think? Hmm? And you have been dating for a year and some months now. Mm-hmm. We've gone on several dates, and we've had to plan them. Mm -hmm. So, I don't understand the part where you had to pull me out from what I was doing to this, this nonsense. I don't get it. Papi, how could you call taking your girlfriend out on a date nonsense? But this should have waited, you should have waited. Oh, Papi, I don't understand what has gotten into you. You were never like this. I mean, you've been acting so cold towards me ever since I got here. I mean, you should have just asked me to stay, that you were busy. Is it not bringing me here and giving me this kind of attitude? I am not giving you attitude. You are the one who has been insensitive and unreasonable. Me? Yes. Insensitive and unreasonable. You know what? I don't know. How can you say that to me? Unreasonable and insensitive. My life, my life. Oh, oh. Hey. people so long? Eh? I went to the houses of the people all you know to collect our money. Mimi? Are you okay? You're looking sick. Her ah, temperature is high. But why did you have to go to their houses to collect the money? Eh? They already said they will pay now. I didn't have a choice. Mimi was sent back from school. Is that true? I thought you've paid. I only need half payment. 
and I promised to complete it next week. That's why I needed to gather the money so I can pay by Monday so she'll be able to go back to school. It's okay. It's okay. Mimi, go in and change, okay? Did you make some good sales today? This place is so messy. It is? I don't think so. You don't think so? Mm -hmm. Look around you. I don't see anything. You are you joking? You don't see the shit on the floor? The, the bed is not even made. fine to me. But if you think it's not good, you could go ahead and dress it yourself. <sighs> yeah, so babe, what are we having for breakfast? Here, have some. <laughs> You're joking, right? You're joking? No. I'm not joking, babe. What's wrong? Wait. Would you rather we have semo and egusi soup or some greasy jello fries? Come on. No wonder you begin to add weight. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, I'm not really saying something that serious, but at least noodle and egg or egg and fried plantain would do. I'd... Babe, those food are not healthy. They're not. Okay, fine. Here's what we're going to do. Why not have fruits this morning? And in the afternoon, I will make you a very delicious ikusi soup. Promise? Promise. <laughs> so, why not sit down and let me feed your test? Come on, sit. You're such a baby. Have some. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> a giant baby. Look at you. You like it, right? I don't know. I don't know. What about Baraka? Okay. Let me hurry up with this so that I can go and make lunch. Okay, ma. Uh, ma, this one is here. Uh, madam? Welcome, sir. Good afternoon, landlord. Uh, I want to beg you in the name of whatever thing you serve. Eh? Kindly pack your things and leave this premises immediately. Ah. Why are you looking at me as if you have seen a masquerade at the UAT? Pack your things and go now. I don't need you in this place again. Ah. Landlord, I I'm confused though. You better not be confused. Was it not a few days ago that you paid him for the month's rent? You, you, you paid what? I'm, 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 you, pay, you paid what for the month? No problem. I don't want you again. Sir, things are not done this way. I don't, who are you to lecture me on how things are supposed to be done in my place? Or oh, is this not like your great grandfather's property? Something that I inherited from my grandfather are telling me things are not done that way. What is your problem, sir? How much do you pay? I paid you 5,000 naira in full for the month, and we haven't even gone half. Oh, because you paid me that 5,000. No worry, 5,000 Abi. You paid 5,000. Because of that 5,000, I will not hear what Abi. No, no. Don't, don't land up here. Don't worry. Thank you paid 5,000. Wait. No, this is your change. Oh, yeah. 
Uh, 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 this uh, uh, land, get out of la the landlord, the landlord, these things are perishable now. Eh? Where do you want us to carry these things to? If you like, go to the bush. If you like, go to the river, I don't care. Take your change and let me... If I come back to this place in the evening, I will destroy everything, you know? I will spoil everything. Why and nothing will happen. Give us time at least to get another place. That for. time is what I do have. Somebody else has already given me block for this thing. Pay me better money here. So that's you. why you're doing this, because someone else gave you money. Collect this money, Jare. Come on, take this thing. By the time I come back this evening, I just see here. Oh. Wag bala ulaga. This is not fair, oh. Don't, don't, life is life fair? Landlord, please now. It's life fair. Don't come on, go, 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 go. Nonsense. Landlord, because you no no eh? Mama, stop begging him. Stop begging him. He's just making empty threats. Ah. Ah. By the time I'll go back here in the evening, you will see what will happen to you. Don't worry! Until the time we paid him elapses, he has no right to come here and throw us out. Then he come. And how much did he even give you? Thousand. Not even a full refund. Hey, this one is wicked. Don't beg him. Just don't worry yourself. Come and sit down. Let him come back. I'm waiting for him. Just, just sit down. Sit down. You can't man. Wait. Uh, are you going somewhere? Yes, I have an appointment to catch up with. Oh, okay. But you won't be using the car. Why not? Because I want to use it. I want to go shopping to get groceries to make lunch for my man. Oh, that's great. But I think you can call a cab or probably use an online taxi. You can take a tricycle out there. There are so many of them out the street. Okay. So why don't you use a tricycle out there? Don't you think? This is my man's car. And I want to use it. Angie, this appointment is very important. And if I don't meet up, it will be very disastrous. Here. Yeah. Well, if your meeting is so important, don't you think you should be out there flagging down a tricycle? <laughs> Steve, get a life of your own and stop taking advantage of Kelvin's good heart. Gosh! Things go wrong for you to be thankful for the right ones. Oh. You did what? No, what, what did you just repeat what you just said now? I was only trying to help you. Help me how? In what aspect? Huh? Who gave you the right to take my key from, from Steve? I'm talking to you. Who gave you such right? Because you're my man. And that's right enough. Oh, really? Just pray to whatever you are worshipping. Anything you're worshipping, just pray. Steve doesn't lose that appointment because if he does, I... Kelvin, what do you want to do? Oh, oh, you want to hit me. You want to hit me because of Steve. Go ahead. Hit me. Kelvin, go ahead and hit me. What is, what, what is the meaning of this? What, what exactly is wrong with you? Huh? Just pray. I'm only trying to save you from that parasitic being like Steve. And instead of you to thank me, you're here shouting at me. Parasitic what? Do you know where we are coming from? Do you know the things that we have been through together? I, I don't want... Just pray, okay? Just pray. You bring light into my world. You're my very sunshine. I've never felt so embarrassed in my life. Angie and I are cool. I mean, you know how much I like and respect her, but for what she did today, I, I never expected it from her at all. 
I understand how you feel. But I've spoken to her. Nothing like this will ever happen again. Seriously, I, I held myself from reacting poorly this morning. And I appreciate it. You know how my anger can get now. I know. Thank you. So tell me, how was your meeting with Mr. George? It went well. He said he would review our proposal and get back to us on Monday. For real? <laughs> well, that's, that's positive. Okay, let me be the first person to congratulate you. For real? Of course. Congratulations in advance. <laughs> <laughs> Did I say something funny? You once told me that I shouldn't get ahead of myself and now you are congratulating me in advance. Please. Well, that, that, uh, that's being optimistic. It's as simple as that. No, no, no. I don't, I don't want to get my hopes up high. Let's keep our fingers crossed. That's just it. Okay, just a moment. Today. I'm sorry. I am really sorry. Please find a place in your heart to forgive me. It's fine. Some days are like that. I'll make it up to you. I promise. No bad blood. Okay. Thank you. Um, let me arrange the table for lunch and I'll let you know when it's ready. All right. You bring light into my world. You're my very sunshine. What's up, bro? Angie made lunch. Are you coming? Yeah, she told me. I'm coming. At least finally, <laughs> someone get to eat a freshly made home food. You see? Homemade food. Homemade food, right? <laughs> well, you need a woman. You need a woman. <laughs> you need one, bro. Men are unnecessarily dramatic. Uh-huh. I'm not mentally capable to handle one. Really? You keep telling yourself that, brother. But one thing you should know is, the earlier, the better. <laughs> you! Hey. Angela! Oh, so biscuits and granite for lunch, like primary school children. Angela! Yes, baby? It's... Angela. Is something wrong? No, nothing is wrong. But what the hell is this? What nonsense is this? Um, babe, it's lunch. Lunch? Mm-hmm. I thought you took the car keys from Steve to get groceries. Um, yes. So? What, 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 why, why, why this? I, um, look babe, I, I went to the spa to make my nails and hands and, and you don't expect me to cook with my freshly made nails. I mean, just look at it. It's, it's just newly done and, if I make food with them, it's going to get dirty. I mean, just look at it. It's beautiful, oh, right? Yeah, they are beautiful. Mm -hmm. So you um, <clears throat> stopped Steve from using the car for office appointment and you took the car and drove your beautiful self 
to aspire and um, you freshly made your nail and polished your hands and therefore it can be used for cooking. Yes, papi. I love that. Mm -hmm. Steve, I'm starving and I want to go out and get something to eat. Are you coming? Because I'm starving to death. Good day, sir. Good day, how are you? Fine, thank you, sir. How much do you sell your bananas? This is 400 naira. This one is 300 naira. This one is 500 naira. This one's here at 250. Okay, let me have that one. You don't have those granite in bottles? Um, no, sir. This is the one we sell around here, sir. Just put four. Okay, sir. So how much is everything? 700 naira, sir. Okay. Um, sir, I've not really made any sales for the day. I don't have this change. It, it's okay, just keep the balance. I'm sorry, sir, I can't. Why don't I owe you or you owe me and next time you're passing, you can always give me. How much is the balance there? It's 300 naira, sir. Then look for a banana that is worth 300 and complete it. Okay, sir. It's better that way. Yes, sir. Thanks, sir. Nobody's agreeing to owe anybody. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. God bless you, sir. Thank you. I wonder why some people, even in their poor state, they still refuse to get help. I don't think I understand what you're saying. No, I'm talking about the banana seller now. Why did she insist on giving us banana instead of taking the, uh, uh, the change? Well, uh, that is called integrity. Like they say, there is dignity in labor. Suffering and smiling, you mean? No, that's not... The tips we're going to give her, was it going to change her life? No. So as a rich man, if you think you want to help someone, give them the kind of help that will transform their life, not leaving them with tips, in my opinion. La 
Love can come in a minute. Life can change in a minute. Love can come in a minute. I think I found peace. Love. <laughs> <laughs> Mama. <laughs> it's okay. The landlord came back, I guess. Yes, and they destroyed everything. This was all I was able to save. Come back. Now I don't know. <laughs> but God has always been with us in all our situations, all our downfalls. And I know this one is not going to be an exception. He will still make a way for us. <laughs> but the most important thing is I need you to stop crying. Okay? <laughs> stop crying. You've always been the strongest one in this team. Okay? Stop crying, my dear. Stop crying. <laughs> Papi, are you really not going to talk to me? You're ignoring me just because of one very little mistake. It wasn't intentional. You called seven, my friend and I, biscuits and granite for lunch. A very little mistake. Do you know how embarrassing that was? Papi, I didn't mean to embarrass you. I'm sorry. Just that my nails, I just... Your nails? There we go again. You're not even willing to change. You know what, I need my sleep. So you're angry? Just because I did not sleep for you and your friend in the kitchen? Kelvin, I am your fiancé, not your maid. Hello? You know, I've had enough of this. Papi, are you just going to walk out? You want to walk out on me? Kelvin, you should be the one apologizing to me, not the other way around. I mean, you refuse to eat the food I gave you with so much love. You refuse to eat it. You should be apologizing to me. Do you know the stress I had to go through? Wow. The stress you went through. Opening the biscuits pack and untying the leather for the granuts. Yes, you should have eaten the biscuit and the granuts. Papi. Papi, come back. Happy. You're still out here? Mm, yeah. I can't sleep. I can't sleep either. I mean, I was sleeping until Angie came and started nagging. Now I can't go back to sleep. Women and drama. You don't even know how peaceful it is being single. Tell me about it. You know, she wants me to apologize for not eating the meal she served with so much love. Talking about the lunch, which is the granite and biscuit she <laughs> served us for lunch. Good God. 
What are you trying to do? Don't get yourself drunk. A little wine? What does she take me for? A fool? I mean, I don't understand it. I, 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 I try everything. Everything just to make sure that she's happy. I give her attention, I give her my love, I make sure that she's okay. Mm. I believe she will change. Things will get a lot easier when you both are married. I'm beginning to have doubts. Seriously. I mean, I love that girl. She used to be such a sweet soul. So sweet and hardworking and... I don't know what happened to her. The moment I slipped that ring into her finger, that was it. She transformed. I don't know what I am doing wrong because I am trying my best to pay her attention the best way I can. I think you should give her some time. You know, women, uh, yeah, 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 you've been trying, but you give her more of your time. Women, they love attention and once they're not getting it as much as they want it, that's when they start nagging. You don't get it. We, we are not even married and, and she's already a nag. I do not want to have to fight with my wife. I want peace in my marriage. I want us to be a team. It is us against the world and everything else and everyone else. It's... If I can't get that, what is the point? Give her more of your time. I'm here to cover you up when it comes to work and all of that. <laughs> That's a little wine. But please, don't get yourself drunk. You know, I really love that girl. Things fall apart for better things to fall in place. Yeah, 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 yeah. Things go wrong for you to be thankful for the right ones. Oh, love can come in a minute, life can change in a minute. Love can come in a minute. I think I found peace Love can come in a minute Life can change in a minute Love can come in a minute I think I found peace oh. You bring light into my world You're my very sunshine, sunshine. When I look into your eyes, I feel the warmth of your soul. Your soul. Love can come in a minute. Love can change in a minute. Man, why are you looking so glum? Is there a problem? It's nothing. No, no, no. Kelvin, the expression on your face is telling me something else. Have you seen Angela this morning? Oh, she drove out a while ago. <sighs> Kelvin, what is going on? Kelvin. Anyways, that's what love is all about. Sometimes you fight. Sometimes you smile. <laughs> things fall apart for mm. better things to fall in place. Yeah, 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 yeah. Things go wrong for Buy you. your banana. To be thankful for the right ones. Oh. You want to buy? Buy your banana. Buy your banana. <clears throat> Auntie, yes. can I have 
Take your water, please. One. Ban Oga. This, your banana way no ripe. It's very ripe and sweet, sir. How much is this one? This one. This one is seven hundred naira, sir. This one is five hundred naira. Two hundred, three hundred. The granite hundred hundred naira, sir. I beg, if you go sell that one, this one now. If you go sell at two hundred. Ah, two hundred naira. Yeah. Yes, now. So that's the biggest of them all. This. Yeah, now. It's not possible. Okay, you can buy this one five. You know what's gonna happen? If you sell that one with one granite, three hundred I go buy. Four hundred with the granite. I'll put that now. Okay. Hope you have changed. Yes, sir. You can see the banana, banana you're pricing two hundred naira. This big banana. <laughs> don't I finish. I just manage that they manage this one now. Thank you, sir. Uh huh. Yeah, I used to do. Gracias. I say well for you. Big eye. See the banana is pricing two hundred naira. Come and carry everything for hundred naira. Where are you coming from? I went shopping, as you can see. Did you take the one million naira I left in my room? Um, yes. Is there a problem? Is there a problem? Who said you could touch that money? Eh? Um, I... I, 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 I what? Papi, I went shopping and... You, 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 you did what? I, I will you spent back. what on shopping? Uh, Is something wrong with you? No, who said you could touch that money? Don't worry, I will pay you back. I will pay you back as soon as I can. I will, I promise. Do you know what that money is for? That money is for the completion of a project Steve and I have been working for. You have by the end of today to return that money. If I don't get it by the end of the day, you will see what I will do to you. Give me my car keys. to fall in place yeah 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 things go wrong for you to be thankful for the right ones oh. love can come in a minute life can change in a minute love can come in a minute i think i found peace love can come in a minute Life can change in a minute. Love can come in a minute. I think I found peace. Oh. You bring light into my world. You're my very sunshine. When I look into your eyes. Hi, Cindy. <laughs> I'm fine. 
How are you? Oh, great. And how's your vacation going? Oh my goodness, that is so great. Oh, that is awesome. <laughs> you know, Kelvin and I are actually making plans to leave the country. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he just wants to clear his decks first. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Um, Cindy, I need your help. Can I get a millionaire from you? I will pay you back once I clear the 8 million naira check Kelvin gave me for shopping. Yes, of course I will. <gasps> Thank you, darling. <laughs> All right, I will send my account number right away. All right, thank you. Have fun. Bye. Oh, thank God. Adam, you're back. Yes, Mama. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you, Mama. Where's Mimi? Okay, I sent her to Mami Joma to go and buy some pepper for me. Okay. How did it go today? Oh, I was able to sell everything, but I didn't make enough profit. It's usually like that. When people say you don't have an alternative and when they, don't, they know you don't have an option, they just like to take advantage of you. In her question, they will just be pricing it anyhow. But it's okay. Not so bad. I'm very hungry. Is there food in the house? Yes, the leftover of yesterday is still there. But please reserve some for me, Mimi. Oh, mm -hmm. one, my dear. You've done well. you do today can stand against you tomorrow life is a long way to go yeah yeah it's a long way to go yeah yeah it's a long way to go yeah, yeah. you better be careful before the more you look the more you look go be the less you see the less you see and you go they confused so say you no go know what else to do you go come the cry oh my life oh my life is falling
Papi, I'm sorry. I know I should have told you before I took the money. It's okay, I got the alert. Yes, I had to do it, knowing how important it is to you. Sorry. Thank you. <laughs> I made us lunch. Mm -hmm. You made lunch? Yes. <laughs> and I made your favorite. Semo and Ikusi soup. And I know you're going to love it. Okay. So, let's go to the dining. All right. <laughs> Come, puppy. <laughs> okay. You will love it. <laughs> what? Wash your hands. Okay. <laughs> Hurry up, just come. Look, I can't wait for you to test. <laughs> Have a seat. Okay. <laughs> so, Have you eaten? Uh, I haven't eaten yet. Angela, Angela, what is this? Egusi soup, of course. Is this how the egusi soup you eat look like? Why do you always have a problem with everything I do? Why? Like, do you know the stress? Do you know the kind of stress I had to go through just to make this for you? That's true. I should appreciate you more, you know. Hmm? Darling, are you come? Come, 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 come. Just sit. <laughs> sit properly, yes. You know you have not eating, right? I cannot be enjoying this beautiful looking meal alone. Why my fiance just watch? Hmm? So I want you to share with me. Come on. Well, eat. I'm not hungry. I know, you just told me that you haven't eaten. Just eat small. Come on, come on. Eat small. Babe, look, I made this for you. I, I know, but there's love in sharing. Just eat a little. Eat some. Okay, if you insist. Mm. Just I should feed you. Uh. Nice, right? Mm -hmm. Very good. Eat more. Ah, uh, Puppy. It's sweet, come I on. I made this for you, so... I know, but you, you need to eat Puppy, I... I, um... Mm. I lost my appetite. Just, I made this for you, just... Angela, even the gods will reject this kind of sacrifice. What is this? A greasy soup? Jeez, I can't even believe you swallowed that. Are you serious? Happy. Oh, goodness. Papi? Yes, darling. I was thinking mm -hmm. I'm listening let's get a meet a meet 
What do we need a maid for? Oh, Papi, to do the chores that I cannot do. <sighs> what chores really in this house? Papi, don't you see how tedious some of the things are? And you know I wasn't brought up to do domestic work. Angela, we don't need a maid. <laughs> Papi, please. Hmm? Please, Papi. Please. Okay, but you know this is not the decision I have to take alone. I need to inform Steve. Why? I mean, we're getting a maid for us. It has nothing to do with Steve. I share an apartment with him. So if anyone else needs to be in this house, he needs to be aware. Fine. You can tell him. I'll talk to him tomorrow morning. Okay. Aren't you going to come to bed? Mm -mm. Come on, I'm Papi. Don't get up. Trying to concentrate here. This is so no. Oh. Come to mommy. Come here. You know you're distracting me, right? Mm. 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 I have to finish. Gentlemen. Honestly, I took time to review the proposal you presented. Permit me to tell you that I wasn't impressed. It is not the best I have received so far. Uh, but sir, you are the boss. You can still do something about it. Though I was impressed, with Steve's pitch deck presentation, which he made. But notwithstanding, I don't see myself giving you an exclusive contract right now. But I can go with non-exclusive for a start. If you guys are up and doing, then I could have a rethink. But for now, non-exclusive. So we will take any opportunity that you give us now. We'll, we'll gladly take it. Exactly, sir. Yes, sir. Hmm. Well, gentlemen, let me say I believe you. By tomorrow, I would like to see you so that my chief accounting officer will sign your first check. And then we will start a deal. Don't play with me. We, we would not dream of it, sir. Thank you so much, sir. I, I, it won't give you any reason to regret it. I hope it sounds... I hope it goes as it sounds. Yes, it's definitely. You know, if you fail, <laughs> I won't be smiling. No, no, no. no. We, wouldn't, we wouldn't be that lazy, sir. Okay. I will be taking my leave now. Come tomorrow, I will ask my CAO to sign some stuff and we will see the entire deal. All right, so that's, that's okay. That's good by us, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Nice Thank you, meeting sir. you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. What? What? Congratulations. <laughs> Let me. How come they always come this tough? My guy, <gasps> my heart was almost skipping. My heart almost jumped out of my body, my brother. Hey. Ah. Major congratulations to you. <laughs> to us. I can't believe we pulled this off. You see, uh, Kelvin. Yes. You need to add some respect to my name. Whenever you want to call me, just call Steve the Great. Okay, you've earned that. <laughs> Steve the Great it is. <laughs> That's what's up. <laughs> it's oh, okay. God. It's okay. There's something I want to discuss with you, though. What is it? It's about Angela. What about her? 
Well, she... <clears throat> Angela wants a maid. A maid? For what? Oh, uh, maybe to... Of course, to help out in the house. The cleaning, the cooking, and... The house chores, basically. Kelvin, that's not gonna happen. There is no much work to do in that house. Except the cooking, cleaning, and washing, which we help at times. I know. I know, but this is like my woman asking for something. And I need to give it to her. Okay, I understand that um, there's really no much work in the house. But we have a lot on our tables these days. And it wouldn't be bad if we have someone who would at least cook us a proper meal. So that she can continue being the baby girl she wants to be. It's okay. No issues. Right? Thank you, my brother. <laughs> Thank you, and congratulations once more. Yeah, it's our deal. And there is no point worrying, because um, I think we can get respons... Not I think, I know we can get responsible ones from this agency, because they have a proper channel for screening them and making sure they are not just hardworking, but well-behaved. No problems now, if that's how you want it. Well, not exactly how I want it. But that's how she wants it. That's what she wants. And you're ready to give it to her. <laughs> Thank you, my Good day, sir. Good day, how are you? Fine, thank you, sir. Do you remember me? No, sir, I don't remember you. My friend and I, we came to your kiosk last time. We wanted to buy a banana. I actually bought and we had the balance. You said we're not going to pay for the oh, change and you refused. <laughs> I remember you now, sir. Good. How are you, sir? I'm fine. I'm fine. So I went back there and I didn't see you. What happened? Are you now hawk, sir? How much do you sell? This is 500, 500, 300, sir. Okay, let me have one. Okay, sir. Mm. <laughs> Sorry, sir. <laughs> it's okay. You want granite, sir? Okay. Sir, you want granite? Uh, do you have? Yes, sir. Okay, bring two. No, so in case I want more of this, how can I find you? Okay, you just give me an address and I'll bring it. Ah, but I need to let you know that I won before you can bring, right? Do you have a number? Um, sir, I, I can give you my mother's number. I don't have a cell phone. All right, call it. Okay, sir. It's 080 okay. 3646. One seven five zero. All right. So, what's the name? Kate, sir. Kate. Right. Here. Sir, again. <laughs> Change. Well, you can keep this. Sir, I'm sorry, but I, I don't take money I do not work for. Don't be angry, sir. How much do you say this one is? And you can, you can owe me. When I bring for you, you can give it to me. You, you can owe me, you know. When you bring it, then I'll... It's fine. It, so, let me have it. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Thank you, you sir. All right, bye. Bye-bye, customer. <laughs> Angela! Angela! <laughs> to put it down? Yeah. You want me to put it down? 
look very excited. Yes, I am. <laughs> what is it? What is? Uh, uh, you want a jackpot? Something better. Okay, you see, we got our first major contract. Oh, delicious. <laughs> and I have a surprise for you. A surprise? Mm -hmm. You know, you asked. You got me a car? Oh, come on, babe. Uh, a Chanel bag? No. Gucci? No. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You know, you asked for something the other day. Uh, you said you wanted someone to help you around the house. Well, I discussed with Steve and. We agreed that we're going to get you your mate. <laughs> yes. Is that a surprise? Yes. Are you not happy that you're getting what you asked for? So you got nothing? What? What do you mean I got you nothing? You... I don't, I don't get it. I, even if you're not happy that... I don't understand women sometimes. You ask, at least if you're not happy for, for getting what you asked for, you should be happy for me for getting a, a huge contract. I don't get it. Really don't get it. Agency has sent some pictures. Are you serious? Yeah. What do you think? <sighs> this would have been good, but she looks too exposed. Nah. But well, you can't really tell if someone is exposed unless you've lived with the person. Oh well, this one is screaming exposure and I don't want to. What about this one? <sighs> Lazy. Look at her very well. Though. She, she, she looks hardworking though fragile. I am looking at her, not exactly my point. Fragile. Lazy, weak, they're all the same thing. I already have a fragile, weak one in the house. So I do not want a lazy one again that I will be paying. Mm. Is, is this all they've got? That's all? I think so. This is useless. I need someone in the house who is hardworking and who can walk round the clock without complaining. Now there's this difference when you pay someone to work and then they begin to look at the work that is too much or being abused. I, I don't want that kind of thing. There's a lot of work in this house and having someone who can do them with gladness will really be appreciated. And that's it, what I'm trying to say. Hey, darling. Are we now taking turns getting mad at each other? Maybe. So what's for dinner? I'm not hungry. But I am. Then go sort yourself out. Don't bother me. For real? Yes. Is this because I didn't get you a gift or there's something else? I don't understand it. Yes. Because you didn't get me a gift. Is that not a big deal? Mm? Wow. You know what? I don't even have time for this. Better. Stay. Stay on your own. Just stay away from me. Things fall apart for better things to fall in place. <sighs> yeah, 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 yeah. Things go wrong for you. So be thankful for the right ones. Oh. 
Hello. A good day. Um, this is Mr. Kelvin from the other day. Yes, yes. How are you doing? Amazing. Amazing. So I want to ask, do you have um, big, fresh bananas? All right, amazing. I want one. And um, can you get me a bottle of granite? You don't have it. No, I really need the bottle. Can you just rally around and get one for me? All right. And um, uh, are you disposed to do home delivery? Oh, that's not a problem. Okay. No, don't worry about that. I would uh, pay you for delivery and also pay you for the um, items. All right. So I'll forward you my address down and you can uh, just be as fast as possible. I would appreciate it. All right. Thank you. Good things fall <clears throat> apart for better things to fall in place. Yeah, 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 yeah. Things go wrong for you. Coming. For the Good, day, sir. Good day. Oh, love can come in your house. It's very fine. Thank you. So, how much is it? Everything is 1,000 naira, sir. 1,000. Mm. I like the banana, it's so fresh. Thank you, sir. Mm. So tell me, how much profit do you make a day? Um, depends on how good the sale for the day is. On a good day, I make 1,000 Naira, but on a bad day, I make 300 Naira profit. Mm. So give or take, you make about um, 30,000 a month. Mm, that's correct, sir. So how about this? You come work for me three times a week, any day of your choice. And um, you do the cleaning, the laundry, and the cooking if you can. And I'll pay you 50,000 naira. 50,000 naira? Mm -hmm. Sir, are you joking? <laughs> of course, I'm not joking. Uh, sure, yes, I can. I can do it. When, when do I start? Today? I'm, I'm ready now. I can start now, sir. Uh, no, calm, calm down. <laughs> uh, you can go home, make arrangements, and then come and resume tomorrow. Is that okay? So you're serious? You're not joking? No, I am not. Thank you, sir. No, 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 no. Don't, don't, oh, bless don't you, do sir. that. Thank Stand you. up. Thank you. No, don't do that. <laughs> uh, yes, um, your transport money, eh? Is, I said I was going to give you your transport money here. Okay, sir. Mm. Uh, sir, um, the bag, can I have the... Bag? Oh, the leather. How about I pay for it? No, no, no. It's okay. I'll no, 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 no. Thank you, sir. God bless you, sir. <laughs> yes, um... Things fall apart for Better things to fall in place Yeah, 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 yeah Things go wrong for you to be thankful for the right ones. Oh. Kate, how well do you know this man in question? Honestly, Mama, I don't really know him. But I feel like he's a very good person. Adam, you're the one I'm worried about. There's something about these rich people that I don't trust. I know, Mama. But I have this feeling that he is not a bad person. Besides, we need the money. We need the money to clear the microfinance bank so that, so that we can move out from this place and get a decent apartment. Truly, this uncompleted building is it's not good for us, especially Mimi. She's always falling ill these days, and I'm sure it's because of mosquito bites. Anyway, I just pray it works out well. 
I have a good feeling. You just be careful. Huh? Just Don't be worry. careful. Don't worry, Mama. Good things fall apart for better things to fall in place. Sorry for keeping you waiting, okay? My fiance will soon be here. Okay, sir. You can sit down. Um, thank you, sir, but I would rather stand. Thank you. Uh, Sterling, this is the girl I told you about. The girl? Yes. Babe, you, you want the smelling, looking gutter girl to walk around the house, clean the house, and cook the food that I will put in my beautiful body? The smelling girl? Babe, darling, hmm. be polite. Okay, talk to her nicely. Polite to who? She? What is wrong with you? I mean, this girl stinks. You know, just ask her to leave. I don't want her. Ask her to go. It's okay, sir. I'll just leave. Good. Stop, Kate. Good. <laughs> what is wrong? We decided this. As a matter of fact, you wanted her. Do you know the trouble I went through trying to get her? But I At don't... this point, whether you like it or not, she's staying. Papi? Kate, Sir. you're going to work for me and that is final. You may not necessarily do anything for her. Just do the work around the house. Right? Okay, sir. Cook, clean, and do my laundries. The ones that you can handle. Is that okay? Yes, sir. Papi, you want her to wash your clothes? Do you know how to cook anything? Yes, sir. I can make all sort of foods. Um, both local and intercontinental dishes. Is that so? Yes, sir. I lived with my aunt, who was an international caterer, but unfortunately she died. Uh, I'm so sorry about that. It's fine. It happened a while ago. Okay. So, um, actually, ABC soup is one of my favorite. Can you do that? Sure, sir. I want you to start Papi. with that. Come, let me Papi, come back here. Papi! Papi, where are you going? Come back here! And you don't even go into my kitchen! What is wrong with Papi? <sighs> You're welcome. So, everything you need is here. You know how to use all this, right? Uh, yes. yes. Yeah. Okay. So, I believe everything you need is here, except for foodstuff. So do your list. Let me know everything you need to stock up this place. Hmm? Okay, sir. All right. Uh, sir, your wife, I don't think she likes me. I don't want you to fight him because of me. Well, she's not my wife yet. We're not married, but we're engaged. Engaged to be married. I don't see any difference. Besides, she lives here with you. Oh, well, she doesn't live here, literally. She came visiting. But I don't want you to worry about her, okay? Mm, sometimes she can be a little bit extra, but she'll warm up to you very soon. Thank you, sir. Good. And then again, I just want to say thank you for everything. God bless him. Katie, you have said thank you countless times, okay? I mean, it's, it's, it's fine. And do not hesitate to come to me if you need anything. Okay, sir. All right. Thank you. TV. In the kitchen. Hey, easy. Hey, morning is good, dude. Hey, how do you? Seriously? Kelvin, seriously? Seriously what? I don't understand what you're saying. Did you really have to insult me in front of that stupid girl? Did you? Oh my god, Angie, you are becoming impossible. Oh, so I am becoming impossible. I am becoming impossible, right? 
Well, you are the one that is becoming impossible. I mean, I already told you that I, I, I don't like that girl. I mean, I can't stand her. I mean, did, you, did you see her hair? Her disheveled clothes? I mean, she is so dirty. I mean, I can't, I can't stand her. Angie, you are becoming a nag. Well, you are turning me into a nag. Maybe if you have known how to cook and probably do some of the little house chores, we won't be trying to hire another person in the house and to think that you are the one who asked for it makes me want to go mad. Don't insult me! I am not insulting you, darling. This is the simple truth. Good day. You're the new house girl? Yes, sir. Wait, wait. The banana girl? <laughs> yes, sir. The banana girl. Wow, wow. So nice to have you here. Thank you very much, sir. <sighs> well done. Thank you. I'll see you around. Um... Kate. Kate. Yes, sir. Wow. A nice thing for a beautiful girl. Thank you. <sighs> Continue. What are you making? Um, egg soup, ma. Egg soup. Hmm. It smells nice. I hope it tastes nice. <laughs> I did my best, ma. I hope you like it. Okay. Ah, oh, I. I forgot my phone in my bedroom. Can you go help me get it? Sure, ma. Uh, uh, don't worry about it. I'll take care of it. Okay. Thank you, ma. Yes. Mm. Huh? Uh, you can continue with what you're doing, huh? Mm. The aroma is so heavenly. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, we get to eat a properly made meal. <laughs> All thanks to Kate. I hope you're not finding your job stressful. Not at all, sir. This is so good. This, this, where are you going? Um, back to the kitchen, sir. Please join us. Join Come us. on. Get your, get your food. Please, join us. Join us. Why are you all forcing her to eat? She said she's not hungry. Let her go. No, this is... Mm. Oh, this is mm. this is good. Homemade, properly. Is it really seasoned differently? It it does. Yeah, that's it. So nice. Mm. You like it? How come? Did you say something? Uh, no, nothing. This is nice. I can't even eat my, my eyes closed. Mm -hmm.
I came out and you were gone. Why? Why did you leave without telling me? I didn't think it was necessary, sir. You didn't think it was necessary. You work for me and that makes you my responsibility. Thank you, sir. Don't do that again. Always inform me before leaving. Look okay, sir. Look, look, look at this, please. It is very wrong for you to be walking here by this time of the day. Where do you stay? Where do you live, young lady? Down the street, sir. Get into the car and give me directions. Is this where you live? Yes. This is an uncompleted building. This is where me and my mother and sister are staying for the moment. We don't actually have enough to rent an apartment. But as soon as we're able to save up, we'll rent a room. I hope you know here is not safe for you. Yes. Oh, that's my mom. Do you want to come down? Oh, sure. I will have to come and say hi to your mother. Mama, Adam. You're still awake. How can I go to bed when you're not back yet? <laughs> Good evening, ma'am. Good evening, my son. Um, Mama, this is Mr. Kelvin, my boss. Oh, Mr. Kelvin, my mother. Really? So you're the good man who gave my daughter the job she's doing now. Thank you so much. God will bless you. Amen. Thank you very much. Thank you, ma'am. Um, why don't you come in and sit down? Oh, I would really love to, but I have to go back home to beat the coffee. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Okay, no problem. But tr try and come around, oh? <laughs> sure, sure. Now. <laughs> you can drop by any time, any time you want, oh? Nah. Yes. Oh, sure. <laughs> I will drop in from time to time. Now. No problem. Yes. <laughs> Um, thank you for bringing me home. Pleasure. See you tomorrow. Drive safe, sir. Sure. Bye, bye bye, bye. Oh. Yes, sir. Thank you, Morgan. Come on. What is that? Hey, you did do a favor now. Uh, we have to show some Mama. gratitude. Things go wrong for you. To be thankful for the right ones. Love can come in a minute. Life can change in a minute. Why are you out here all by yourself? Waiting for my man. And why would you leave the house without telling me anything? Oh, uh, I discovered Kate was going home late. And uh, you know how this area can be around that time. So I just gave her a ride home. Oh, amazing. Great. You know, I, I honestly don't understand you. Can you tell me what exactly was going on? What do you mean, what exactly is going on? What is that supposed to mean? I mean, why would you have to go drop Kate off? Is she a child that she cannot find her way home? Doesn't she know the way to her house anymore? I'm, I'm, I'm not doing this. Please, I am not. Is there something going on between you and that dirty girl? Are you, are you really asking me that question? Of course I am. I mean, you need to tell me something because I do not understand what is going on. Angela, you have a dirty mind and that is not good for you. I just told you I helped, that's all. She is my staff, okay? She's my domestic staff and I owe her that responsibility of taking care of her. Responsibility, my foot. There's something else you are thinking. Keep thinking that. 
Keep talking. She's so mean. Mm -hmm. I've never seen a more wicked person. It's Yoko. Hmm. You will not believe what she did. Mm, tell me. I was in the kitchen, you know, working and minding my business, preparing a gossip soup. She then came and told me that I should go to the room and bring her phone. Only for me to return. Tested my soup and found out that she poured a whole lot of salt inside the bottle of soup. Jimmy. Yes, Mama. <laughs> and I remember that thing you taught me how to use Irish potato to absorb salt. That yeah. was what I did. <laughs> you needed to have seen her face when she tested the soup and found out that it wasn't so salty. <laughs> that is good. That is very good. And the most important thing is that Mr. Kevin is not like her. No, Mr. Kevin is not like her at all. Mr. Kevin is so kind. Not just him. Even his friend, Uncle Steve, is also very nice. She's the only one that has issues. But, Kate, if you ask me, if this job is going to give you a hard time, I suggest you quit now. Yes, eh, we might not have much, yes. But we're not hungry. We are not starving. Mama, quit. No, this golden opportunity. I'm going to grab it. Don't worry, I'll just totally ignore and avoid and just face my work. Don't worry. You still need to be careful. Such women can be very vicious. Mama, don't worry, I'll be fine. Yeah, you're going to wash all these clothes. And make sure you use your hands. Do not use washing machine to wash them. Oh yeah, pack them. Okay, ma'am. But why if I may ask? Why what? Anyways, good question. I don't like my clothes being washed in the machine. So you use your hands. Pack them. And hurry up because you still have other things to do. Okay, ma. I'm giving you 10 minutes to finish those clothes. 10 minutes. Welcome, sir. Kate. Sir. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Why are you washing the clothes with your bare hands? There is a washing machine in the laundry room now. Um, Aunt Angela said she preferred her clothes being washed with bare hands. What nonsense. It's okay, sir. I have actually forgotten how it feels like to use washing machine for laundry. And this is faster. It's all right. Continue with what you're doing. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Papi. He's having a meeting with our client. Ah, uh, okay. I saw Kate outside washing clothes with her bare hands. Why? I don't know. I mean, is that not what we are paying her to do? Wash clothes? There is not one but two washing machines in that laundry room. Why make her wash clothes with her bare hands? Hello? I don't answer to you. So know your place in this house. Oh, that's right. And I'm so grateful that I don't have a woman as despicable as you who answers to me. Watch your mouth, Steve. Do not insult me. Why do you even hate this girl? Who you don't even know. You don't even know where she's coming from or what she's been through. You just developed this deep, unnecessary hatred for her. Like I said earlier, I don't answer to you. You should always treat people the way you would want to be treated. Just get lost. Get out! 
good things fall apart for Bad with things to fall in place Yeah, 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 yeah Things go wrong for you To be thankful for the right ones oh. Get back, get back, get back! Stay, stay away from me! Girl, you smell! When last did you wash your mouth? This morning. This morning. Yes, ma. <sighs> Make sure you don't open your mouth when talking. Because you're going to send someone to an early grave. Huh. Gosh. Have you cleaned the bathroom? Yes, ma. Um, go make me noodles. And make sure you wash your hands thoroughly. And don't talk or sing when preparing my meals. Bama, it's almost 5 p.m. I need to go to the market to buy food stuff, make dinner before Uncle Kevin returns. Um, don't worry, I'll talk to him. So I shouldn't make dinner today. Um, yeah, you can do that tomorrow. Okay, ma. Thank you, ma. Just go. Yeah, I was. Well, we're fine. I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you, Kate. Sir. Kate. Sir. What are we having for dinner? Um. I. I didn't make dinner today, sir. You didn't make dinner. What were you doing all day? Mm-hmm. Go on. Answer. What were you doing all day? My fiance is asking you a question and you're looking at me. Go on and answer. Sir, so I, I did laundry and I cleaned the whole house. That doesn't seem like a tough job to me. I mean, it's just to clean the house. Angie, can you let us speak? Fine. Have you had something to eat? No, no, sir. But I'm not hungry. Nonsense. Go and get your things. I will drop you home. And while we're going, to stop at a restaurant and grab some dinner. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. God bless you, sir. You're welcome. Okay. I, 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 I don't understand. Like, what just happened? Baby, you're supposed to reprimand her for not making dinner. Come on, babe. That's not what she needs right now. She looks tired and hungry and... <laughs> don't you look at her And so think... what? Oh, so you want to take her to a public restaurant where people would see you, my fiance, with that thing? Oh, babe, come on. That is just so low. That is so low. I mean, that is just insane. I can't even, I can't even think of it. I can't believe it. <sighs> Papi. What about me? Don't you think I'm hungry as well? Angie, I walked in on you eating noodles. But if you think you're still hungry, you're welcome to join us. But Papi, not with that dirty <sighs> girl beside you. Kate. Hell no. I mean, I... Gosh. You're so bright. Why are you not in school? Well, I dropped out in my first semester in my year one after my aunt died. Oh, I'm sorry about your aunt. That means she would have been in your final year now. My mom could not continue to sponsor me, so I, I dropped out. What about your dad? What happened to your dad? My dad died when I was 11. 
funny thing is, we used to have a lot of money. Yes, growing up, I had everything I wanted. My dad was not the richest, but we were very comfortable. Would you believe that? We even had a maid and a driver. Really? It's just funny how the table turns. Not long enough. So what exactly happened? Dad had taken a loan from the bank for a business that failed. So after he died, the bank froze his account and took everything. My goodness, that's that's heartless. Things are a lot better now. Before mom had to beg before I can even eat once a day. At least now we can it's a four to eight twice a day, which is not bad. You have a sibling? Yes. I have one sibling, Mimi. Mom was pregnant with her when my dad died. <sighs> oh my goodness, I... I'm sorry. For what, sir? for everything that you had to go through. It is so sad. Okay, don't worry about it. This food is really nice. <laughs> of course she is. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much for taking me to dinner. Pleasure is all mine. And I'm sorry I won't be coming in. Just help me say hi to mom. Maybe some other time. Okay. Good night, sir. Good night. Drive carefully. Hi. And you take care of yourself. Sure. is a very nice man. No? Yes, Mama. He's very nice. And I think he likes you. Mama. Mm. Where are you getting your ideas from? I told you he has a wife and she lives with him. And even if he doesn't, what makes you think that a man like Mr. Kelvin will have interest in someone like me? Someone like you? Meaning what? Anyway, let's not talk about that. Is she still giving you troubles? Hmm. Yes, so Mama. Every day, different problem. Today, she kept sending me on different errands and told me to prepare um, a plate of noodles for her in the evening. I told her about dinner. She said I should not worry that when Mr. Kevin returns, she would tell him. Mr. Kevin came back and was demanding for his dinner. She was just sitting right there. I was looking at her so that she would say, eh, I was one that told her not to. Hey, this lady did not say anything. She acted like, yeah. like she did not even know what I was talking about. Like I purposely didn't want to make dinner for Mr. Kelvin. But, but what really surprised me was, instead of Mr. Kelvin to be angry, he asked me if I've eaten. I said no. He said, okay, that I should join him for dinner. We now went outside and ate together. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah, my daughter. <laughs> that is the main reason why you need to keep your hands clean and keep your path straight. Once you do this, God will always throw your enemies under the tires of a moving truck. Insane. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Things fall apart for better things to fall in place. Yeah, 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 yeah. Things go wrong for you. 
to be thankful for the right ones. Love can come in the minute. Life can change in the minute. Love can come in the minute. I think we found peace. Love can come. Is there something you want to say? Um, sir. What do you do for a living? I beg your pardon. Um, sir, please don't be angry. It's just that you're always with your laptop. I'm curious to know. Are you doing Yahoo Yahoo? <laughs> oh God. <laughs> okay, come sit with me. Come and sit with me. Sit here. Mm. You see, it's very wrong to think that every young man working with a laptop is an internet froster. There are so many ways to make money on the internet. Yes, just check this out. I don't understand anything. <laughs> okay. Uh, Kelvin and I co-own an advertising agency. So whenever you see me this busy on the system, I am tracking promotions for our clients. Wow. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm sorry that I thought that. No, 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 no. You don't have to be sorry. See, I'm even happy you asked. Yes. Kate, you're a very bold girl. And I like that in a woman. You're not mad at me. Not at all. You see, for the fact that you asked me, I'm so happy. See, other people will just assume anything and the next thing they start spreading false rumors, which might land an innocent person into prison. Um, how long have you known Uncle Kelvin? Oh, since our university days. Hmm? Yes, we were roommates. And uh, then we became best friends. But now we are more than that. We are brothers. This is so good. I envy your friendship. <laughs> uh, we complement each other in so many ways, especially in our business. You see, 10 years ago, we planned on uh, establishing a company. Naturally, people will say that co-founding a company with your best friend is a bad idea. But I will tell you categorically, they are very wrong. Yes. You see, in this business, I am more of the risk taker. Yes, who is so excited about new opportunities. But Kelvin is the executor. Yes. And he's not even afraid to tell me where my idea would take us to, you know, that kind of a thing. He's a very great guy. Yes, he is. And, and you too. <laughs> you both are so kind. <laughs> it's because we know where we started from. Our story is that of grass to grace, if I may put it that way. Um, let me not bore you with my nonsense. You have to go and continue what you're doing before your madam comes for your neck. <laughs> you know how it is. <laughs> Thank you for having to stop me. Always. Love can come in a minute. Yeah, you're Life welcome. can change in a minute. Love can come in a minute. I think I found peace. Love can come in a minute. Life can change in a minute. Love oh, can come in a minute. Very intelligent. Girl. I think I found peace. Kate, I have been looking all over for you. Come give me a massage. I'm, I'm, Ma, I have something on fire. Don't make me repeat myself. I said, come and give me a massage. Hello, babe. Welcome, sir. Kate, how are you? I'm fine, thank you, sir. Papi. How are you? I'm fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. Take care of yourself, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? I mean, it's, it's just Kate and you. What are you still doing here? Come on, get out. Go! Babe, what? Why do you enjoy talking to her like that? Well, I can't, I can't stand her. Life can change.
change in a minute. Love can come in a minute. I think I found the peace. Love can come in a minute. Life can change in a minute. Love can come in a minute. I think I found the peace. What are we having for dinner? How are you? Fine, sir. Um, boiled plantain and egg sauce. Mm. Sounds delicious. <laughs> How's your mom? She's fine. She sends her regards. Hmm. I've been meaning to ask you, when do you plan on going back to school? <sighs> as soon as I'm able to save up enough money, I'll go back to school. Hmm. So how about this? I loan you the money. Mm -hmm. Since you don't take things from people, then you still be working for me while you go to school from here. And then we can check and balance later. How about that? Wait, are you joking, sir? Mm, I'll, be, I'll be honored to sponsor you a bride. Oh my God, sir. Thank, Thank you, you so much. <laughs> I'm so sorry, sir. I, I, I was overly excited. Um, forgive me. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. We'll talk some more about this tomorrow. Then carry on with what you're doing. Hmm? Good things fall apart for better things to fall in place. Yeah, 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 yeah. Things go wrong for you. To be thankful for the right ones. Oh. Good day, sir. I told you to call me Steve. I know, sir, but it will take a while before I get used to addressing you by your name, sir. <laughs> Sorry, Steve. All right. Isn't the song too harsh on you, like doing this here? Um, I'm, I'm almost done. There is something on your hair. Where? Here? No, no, no. Not there. Here? Not there. Wait, wait, wait. Thank you, sir. You're very beautiful. Don't flatter me, sir. Honestly, even without makeup and expensive clothes, you are the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. Um, I need to finish up with the car. Yeah, I know. I was already on my way out. Just to take a walk. I'll see you when I get back. Okay, sir. Hi, sir. What was he discussing with you? Um, nothing serious, sir. What exactly was he telling you? Um, he... Uh, nothing serious, sir. You, we're just talking. Are you done? No, sir. I'm almost done. Then you were discussing. You're not done. Sorry, sir. And hurry up and finish up. I need to go out. Okay. Um, Sorry, sir. Good things fall apart for better things to fall in place. Yeah, 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 yeah. Things go wrong for you to be thankful for the right ones. Oh. Love can come in a minute. Love can change in a minute. Love can come in a minute. I think it's found peace. Love can come in a minute. Life can change in a minute. Love can come in a minute. I think. Yes, ma'am! I'm coming.
called me. Yes. Um, Kate, I figured I have been very mean to you since you started working with us. And I just want to say that I am sincerely sorry. Really? Yes, I am. And that is why I want to give you this clothes. Because I... Where is it? I figured you've been wearing these clothes more often. So you can have them. Here. Ma. These clothes look so expensive. I'm sorry, I can't take them. What if they're very expensive? Come on, Kate. Look, I have so many clothes. Hmm? I really want you to take them. If you've really forgiven me, then you will take the clothes because it's going to make me very happy. Hmm? Thank you very much, Ma. God bless you. It's nothing. Come on, take. Here. <laughs> Thank you very much, Ma. God Make sure you me. wear them, huh? Eh? I sure will. Thank you, Ma. Right. Ah, oh, you're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> things fall apart for bad with things to fall in place. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Are they going somewhere? Yes, I'm having a meeting with a client over at dinner and I do not want you to wait for me, okay? Okay. Um, Kate! Kate! Are you done? Uh, no, sir. I'm almost done. It's just the pot's left. Uh, just leave that. You finish up that tomorrow, okay? Get your things. Let me drop you off. All right, take care of you. Sure. Kate! Kate! What is it again? I'm running late. What do you have in that bag? Clothes, ma. Let me see them. My clothes? What are my clothes doing in your bag? Hmm? You gave them to me. Shut up! How dare you? How dare you steal my clothes? Angela, why would you slap her like that? Papi, you need to fire this girl. You need to fire her, else I will call the cops on her. I didn't get it from you. You gave them to me, remember? I said, shut up! Ma, you gave me these clothes yourself. You know that you Shut gave me up! This. I did not see from her, I promise. But you gave Papi, me she's this. lying. Look at my clothes. Kate. What, what are my clothes doing? Kate! 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 Papi, she stole them. Come with me. Yeah, I Just promise fire I did not see from fire her. her. You did this. Kate, I said, stand up! From you. Yes, she sir, get out! The truth, get promise. out! Come with me. Sir, Papi, make sure you make sure she doesn't go back to this house. Go! Get out! Things go wrong for you to be thankful for the right ones. Oh. Kate, can you just stop crying? I can't take you home like this. Why I did not steal your wife's clothes. She gave them to me. I am not a thief. I've never stolen in my whole life. I know. You do? Mm -hmm. See, Kate is my woman. I know what she's capable of. You, on the other hand, I just met you. And I know what you can and cannot do. Yes. You're not angry? Yes, I am angry, but not with you. So can you just clean those tears and stop whimpering like a child? See, Angie and I are not married. And until we are married, you refer to her as my fiancé, not my wife. Thank you. For what exactly? For trusting me. Can you clean all of the tears so that I can take you home? I have a meeting to catch. Okay. Things fall apart for bad 
right where things to fall in place Yeah, 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 yeah Things go wrong for Come you To be thankful How are you? for I'm the fine. right one Can you please do me a favor? Help me pick something decent for her. Sure. No, no, sir. It's totally not necessary. You don't have to. Really? You know, if you're thinking of going back to school, you should be planning on taking the advantage you have now to upgrade your wardrobe. You don't have to say no to everything. Thank you, sir. And you have to cut down a little bit on the thank you. <laughs> I'll try, sir. Now go ahead, pick something, pick anything. You bring light into my world. You're my favorite sunshine. When I look into your eyes, I feel wow, the warmth of your soul. All this? Hmm. Yes, Mama. I was shocked too. Hi! Gide? <laughs> eh, <Hey>, whoa! <laughs> These things must have cost a fortune. Hmm. Mama, they are very expensive. Look at hey. it now. Chai! Big girl's clothes. This is the one they see, they call uh, spaghetti hand. It was in my crew. Spaghetti. I hear that. Don't you think it will look better on Mimi? Ah! It will just bring out. Uh, Mama. I'm just suggesting. <laughs> I'm just suggesting. Hey! Hey! Mm. I like this color. Mm, I know, you have a thing for red and yellow. <laughs> and to think he wants to send you back to school. Mama, this is God working. Just when I thought I'd lost hope, and now God just sent an angel to send me back to school. Yes. Oh, bless Mr. Kelvin. <laughs> Mama, wait. I got my first salary today. Hey. 50,000 Naira cash, hey. Mama. Hey. I'm telling you. Hey! Mama. We can use this money to start paying for the loan we took from Microfinance Bank to start our food business. And then the rest we can buy food stuff and pay Mimi school fees. Kate, so Evelyn, I can one day touch money like this again. Hmm. Mama, you will touch more. You will touch bundles. Don't worry. By the time I go to school and graduate first class, hmm. I will buy us a mansion Hi. and buy you a car. You will not be checking again. I trust you, my daughter. Come, mom. You will fool my cool Eh? Hey! Jesus, I'm going to walk in the air. 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 You bring light into my world. You're my favorite sunshine. Kevin, you lie. I am not going anywhere. I am not leaving this house. But you need to go home and make plans with your parent. Plans? Mm -hmm. What plans are you talking about? <gasps> Wait. Does it mean you're finally ready? <laughs> hmm? That's what I've been trying to tell you, Les Chess. <laughs> Is that it? Mm hmm. <sighs> okay. <laughs> That's what I've been trying to tell you. Mm -hmm. I've been trying to tell you to go home, stay with your parents for some time, then let me clear what's on my table. Then after I'm done, I'll come with my people for introduction. Please! I, are, you, are you serious? I am very serious. Oh my god! Papi, I am so happy! I know. You're the best! Wait, you know what? I, I, I can't wait to tell my friends. I can't wait to tell Tessie, yeah. Cindy, yeah. I mean, they're all... Where's your phone? Get your phone. Get your phone. Get your phone. I can't believe you tricked her to leave. 
like Kelvin. That's not fair. You shouldn't have done that. But what would you have me do? I mean, her presence and attitude was beginning to choke me. I needed to breathe in my own house. Oh, sincerely, Angela is too much like... Okay. Is it a breakup? Maybe. You know you're right. A marriage is not something you rush into. What was that about? What? The way you looked at her. Oh, um, she's a very pretty girl, like, very down to earth and hard working, so why don't I look at her? Are you interested in her? Who wouldn't be? <laughs> like, <laughs> Kelvin. Oh, you amaze me sometimes. <laughs> Is this all that you need? Yes, sir. Why? <laughs> I can't see accommodation here. Wait. I hope you're not taking seriously what I said about you staying here and going to school. <laughs> no, no, no. You should stay in the hostel. It's safer for you there. No, sir. I want to live here with you. I mean, I would like to live here and... I mean, I like to stay... I would, I would like to stay here and work for you. That's what I meant. Even if I am a grumpy boss? <laughs> You've never been a grumpy boss. You're very kind. So, where were we? Things fall apart for better things to fall in place. Yeah, 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 yeah. Things go wrong for you to be thankful for the right ones. Oh. Is this where you live? Yes, this is where I crawl out from every day. Kelvin told me he's making plans for you to go to school. Yes, he is. And I have him to thank for that. Yeah, that's great. Don't hesitate to let me know if you feel like I can assist in any way. <laughs> thank you so much. You have done more than enough for me already. You and Kelvin have successfully and totally changed the course of my life. More than I even imagined. Thank you so much. May God bless you. You're welcome. Um, what about your mother? Mm. Is she home? Because <laughs> the house looks like... I'm sure she's inside or maybe somewhere around. I would like to see her. Okay. Let's go. All right. I'd like to discuss something with you. Really? What is it? Uh, 
Yes, I just completed my building, not too far from here. Ah, huh, that's nice. So I would like you people to move into one of my flats. No, my son. But no, no. That would be greed on our part. Eh? You will have done more than enough for us already. We can't ask for more. My mother is right. Thank you for trying to help us. But I think we can manage. Mm -hmm. This is the least I can do. Considering the fact that Kelvin had already taken care of your schooling. So please, don't refuse me. Why? Why do you want to help us? Because it's the right thing to do. And because I like you. You see, I, I like you very much. I don't understand. Kate, I have loved you right from that very day I came back from work and saw you cleaning. Mama, I love your daughter. If given the chance, I would love to take very good care of her. I am so sorry if I'm being too forward or pushing it hard on you. I'll just give you some time to think about it. Mama, I'll be on my way. I have a very important appointment to catch up with. All right, my son. Thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you. All right, kid. All right, then. This one is hard. What are you going to do now? I don't know, Mama. I feel like you should have discussed his feelings to me in private instead of just bluffing it out like that. He embarrassed me. Embarrassment? That's the one you're thinking about. This is more than embarrassment here. Can't you open your eyes and see? There is a strong love triangle happening between these two friends and you. And if my suspicions are correct, it is going to be disastrous. What do you mean? Are you telling me you've not noticed the way Kevin looks at you? You don't know Kelvin likes you. <laughs> Mama, what are you talking about? No, he doesn't. He has a fiancé. <laughs> he has a fiancé. Uh, which one? The one that they have sent back in? That's not what I told you. I told you that she only traveled. I know what you told me, I remember. But that means you don't know the world of men. Let me let you in on a little secret. That was just a ploy to get her out of the house. That girl is gone, she is not coming back to that house ever again. Eh? He just craftily sent her away. Good day. You look different. I know, I know, right? I actually don't feel comfortable in this. No, 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 no. I mean, you look super gorgeous. Thank you, sir. So, do you need help? <laughs> what can you do? Don't try me. I can do a lot of things. I can even cook. Okay, like? Like I can boil hot water with uh, maybe, <laughs> <laughs> maybe some egg or, you know, something inside of it. That's that I, it? No, no, there, there, there. In fact, enough of the talking. Okay. Why don't you? Hmm? <laughs> See, pretty here. While I cook for you. Yeah? You are beautiful. And I would love to make you mine. Oh, 
You are a strong, beautiful woman with an incredible soul. You are a wonder to behold. You are loving, caring, and likable by almost all. You have been through a lot. But with everything you've been through, you you are able to find a way to land on your both feet. I love everything about you, Kate. I love you so much. I love you too, Kelvin. But... This... There's no but. Okay? You love me, that's all that matters. I love you and I want to be with you. And you love me too, that's all I want to hear. And don't worry about Angela. Mm -hmm. She's not coming back. Mm -hmm. She... Um, she was more interested in money than she was interested in me, so... I paid her, or should I say, I compensated her heavily. Okay, but what about Steve? What do you mean, what about Steve? Um, he... He professed his love for me in front of my mother, so I'm just a bit confused. He did what? <laughs> Don't you such tone on me. Are you crazy? Stay away from her. And who are you to tell me what to do and what not to do? You do not want to see the other side of me. Stay away from her. What will you do? You Iboshi, please, please stop it. I beg you, please. What did you say? What will I do? Calvin, I said, what will you do? Don't you dare touch me again. Don't touch me again. You do not want to see the other side of me. Calvin. See, you can never stop me from going after my Unfortunately heart. for your stupid heart, it doesn't want you. She wants me. Let her say it. What do you mean, let Emma. her say it? No, please. Just, just stop it already, I beg you. Come on. You two are good friends for crying out loud. Steve, you told me how, how you guys have been, have been good friends from university. You even told me how you both started your business together. I, I don't want to be the one responsible for, for breaking this, this beautiful relationship. Sorry, but I have to go. Goodbye, both of you. No. You. You. You what? Kate! Kate! I'm sorry. I know I messed up. You shouldn't have confronted him. You shouldn't have. I, w I was going to politely tell him that you and I are together. But now you have ruined everything. I'm sorry, I should have trusted you to be able to handle everything on your own. I'm not the one you should be apologizing to. Tell but hear everything the both of you spoke about. Mama, he shouldn't have confronted him. His temperament is so bad. Mm. The temperament of a jealous man who is in love. That doesn't mean he will always be like that. 
And come to think of it, you are partially to blame for what happened. Yes, you are. Huh? Did you have to tell him about Stephen? No. You don't know that it is not everything a woman sees or hears that she tells a man. I, I didn't think it through. I know you didn't. But you need to see Stephen. Why, Mama? You see, you need to personally explain to him how you feel about Kelvin. And if truly he loves you, he will let you go. You have to go and see him. Um, I... Kevin told me you moved out. That's right. Does it have anything to do with me? No, no, no. You know, I told you and your mother that uh, I recently completed my house. So trust me, Kelvin and I are cool. We have even had worst fights. That's what friendship is all about. So we'll fight this minute, the next minute we're dining together. I'm very sorry. <laughs> For what exactly? I don't know. I just have this feeling that I'm the cause of everything that happened. Steve, I'm so sorry. But the thing is, I truly love your friend Kelvin. I've loved him for a very long time, even before he made his intentions known to me. I didn't know how to tell you because I wasn't so sure if he liked me too. I'm so sorry. Really it's, sorry. it's all right, it's all right. You don't have to explain anything. I totally understand. So tell me, are you both getting married? Well, yes, but that will be when I'm done with school. Yeah, that's great. I must say, Kelvin is a lucky guy. <laughs> with everything that has happened, I'd say that I'm the lucky one. <laughs> you bring light into my world. You're my fairy sunshine. sunshine. This place was very big and beautiful. Mama, are you serious that we'll be living here? Yes, my daughter. We'll be living here from now on. Do you like it, Mimi? Yes, I love it. I told you you would like the place. <laughs> Thank you so much, my son. Mama, I've told you to stop thanking me. We're one big family now, huh? Yes, we are. But even at that, thank you. <laughs> it's okay, Mama. Please do settle in. Hey, you help Mama to settle in. Okay. okay. And you take care of yourself. I'll be back soon. Let me just have the meeting with Steve. Okay? Okay, have yeah. a good one. All right. And um, please come back just in time for dinner, okay? You know that I will not miss that for anything in the world, huh? <laughs> come here. Take care of you. Okay. Take care of you.
zum 